Hey, what's up everyone on YouTube? This is me, Devin, bitches. And right now you have click on my motherfucking reality TV show, bitches. And just thought to let everyone know that these videos are all just for a laugh. Because my life is that fucked up that you can laugh at it, y'all. <laughs> but yeah, totally. How can you not know who this gorgeous blonde bitch is? Like, honestly, how can you mistake any blonde skank for this one? Because I'm the awesomeness of all those fucking blonde whores out there. I'm better than all of those fucking blonde bitches. Yeah. But yeah, totally, I went into my dad's room to get a fucking lighter because I wanted to do fucking tobacco poppers because this bitch is out of fucking weed and I'm stressed and fucking cranky and want to totally whip someone's fucking head off their fucking face and then shove it right back up their fucking ass and watch them fucking die slowly by the head up their fucking asshole. Totally, that's how fucking stressed I am. But then the fucking cats just start fucking like fucking crazy. Just fucking cramming each other. And then my dad saw there's a fucking bitch out there and told him not to fucking come. Not to fucking come on his fucking bed. Totally. But yeah, I fucking hate Twitter. It's driving me fucking crazy. Trying to make a motherfucking video telling people about my fucking day and Twitter's fucking going off like fuckers. Stop retweeting and liking so much shit when I'm trying to do something. Or, better yet, better yet, how about y'all just drop dead? I don't know, I'm a little fucked up right now. <laughs> and I love it, oh my god. Like, I feel so happy. Like, oh my god. Yeah, no one can break down this bitch. Yeah. I have to say, probably, I think the weed pill probably made me a little fucking extra, just a little bit. Because I'm all jittery and jumpy and I'm ready to fucking go. Like, oh, I love it. Love it. Love it. Yeah. But yeah, I totally don't go back to school, Joe. January 14th because I fucking whipped my phone at this guy's fucking face and gave him a cut up lip and a wet fucking face. It was this dude in my fucking math class who was totally fucking pissed me off trying to say I was less intelligent and I'm a retard and I'm dumb and stupid because I swear a lot and all that and I'm just like I agree to fucking disagree. Because I fucking believe people who swear a lot are actually high intelligent because they have more to fucking say than the average person. So the only thing that comes out is swear words. That's like the only thing that comes out because that's the only thing they can express how they fucking feel and all of that. And I told him, I agree to disagree, so just drop it. And he kept talking his fucking smack, talking his smack, saying my parents don't raise me right, obviously, if I've been swearing since I was six years old. Bitch is called I was in fucking pain from the cancer treatments and all that, and fucking through a lot of pain, I'm obviously gonna be swearing, you dumb fuck. Like, go eat another cheeseburger, why don't you, and learn something about fucking cancer and the treatments and you try not fucking swear when you have fucking whack poisons pumped through your fucking veins every single fucking day. So I got mad and I whipped my phone in his fucking face and gave him a cut up lip right here and a red fucking face. It was actually so fucking funny. I walked out of fucking class, I smashed the window and fucking he tried to say, oh, I'm not going to the office because I'm not going to the office when I just got punched in the face. I saw him right back in the fucking classroom. I was like, bitch, firstly, I didn't fucking punch you. I fucking threw my phone at your fucking fat little face. It's so different than being punched than getting a phone thrown at you. So go suck yourself, you dumb fucking fat fucking fucker. Like, go eat a fucking cheeseburger, why don't you? That's all you fucking do is sit on your fat fucking ass and eat those cheeseburgers at McDonald's and totally fucking just be a fat fuck all in general. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so now I'm suspended. I got a 10-day suspension. But I don't give a fuck because totally I have a longer Christmas now. I can sleep in and do whatever. And I don't really care. I'm, I'm thinking about just dropping out of high school anyway. If I keep being harassed and bullied, and if I feel like the school is just fucking me around by getting my credits and all that, because yeah, I lash out, but I wasn't the one who wrote up the suspension. I wasn't the one who wrote the 10 day suspension. It was the fucking school board. Totally not my fucking problem if I don't have time to complete all my culminatings and all my tests and all my work I have to do. Not my fucking problem. It's the school problem. And if they just fuck me around and won't give me the credits, this bitch is dropping out. Fuck it. 
because totally I get Ontario disability, which means I get money from the government every month to take care of myself and all that. So tell me, why the fuck am I graduating for the glory of fucking people saying you did it and all that? You know what? I'm only doing that because I'm sick and tired of people thinking because I have FAS that I'm a fucking retard. But honestly, I, your opinions don't fucking matter. So I'm going to go back in a positive fucking attitude on January 14th. But if anything fucking starts and if I get annoyed, this bitch is dropping out. I don't give a fuck. Bye. So yeah, that was my interesting fucking last day before the Christmas break. And yeah, now I'm just chilling high on a wheat peel. Feel fucking great. Bye. Bye. Bye.